the idea for Europe Code Week actually started from my own experience in organizing programming workshops for women. And I kept hearing all over again how um, women were talking about how they have this great business idea and they have no technical knowledge on how to implement it. And I think, you know, there's a lot of untapped potential here. And as we hear, you know, there's going to be a lot of uh, unfilled digital jobs available. Uh, and yet, you know, I see my peers not finding jobs. So that was the idea behind Euro Code Week. Uh, basically, you want to see what's going on all over Europe. Various organization, organizations like Race Girls, Color Dojo that are already doing things to teach kids, women, adults, you name it, about computer programming. So they learn more, more about technology. And it's not about making programmers. I'm not a programmer myself, but it's about encouraging people to be uh, digitally active, not just consumers of content, but creators. And it, of course, also connects you know, to uh, encourage people to start thinking about their own startups and so on. I was like hoping for to get 10 countries involved, maybe do 10 events in each country. Uh, the result of one month of promotion, you can see on the maps that uh, have been distributed to you. So we have over 300 pins all over Europe. So this includes um, code, um, code Week events taking place this week plus other initiatives that can help you learn more about technology throughout the year. So, I mean, the response has been amazing. Two most active countries, as you can see from our map, have been Ireland and Croatia. And those are the two countries uh, where we had uh, school teachers as ambassadors. So school teachers promoting this effort. So I think this just goes to show how important teachers are, you know, for spreading this knowledge and um, encouraging their communities. I think we did well, especially considering our bad budget of exactly 0, 0.0 euros. Now we have already people asking us uh, what's going to happen for Cold Week next year. <laughs> we would like to see maybe more companies involved in this, um, supporting schools and all that, because, you know, this 300 pins, it's most, mostly volunteers. We should do more. Um, so UK, Ireland already has plans on introducing coding into schools, um, but I think this should be just the beginning because there is a lot of will in Europe. <laughs>